The appointment of Metropolitan Municipal and District Chief Executives has been blamed partly for the ineffectiveness of Ghana's local governor's system. No wonder a lot of contributors during the Constitutional Review Commission meetings under the late Professor Mills' administration insisted on MMDCE's election. But a seeming lack of political will, which has over the years kept the people from their desire, appears to be giving way. We are hoping that MMDCs will be elected in 2021. The key obstacle in getting our MMDCs elected is amendment of Article 55.3 of the 1992 <coughs> Constitution, which is an entrenched clause. Hajia Alima Mahama disagreed with claims that electing MMDCEs may create political challenges, making reference to Kenya, South Africa and Rwanda, which have understudied Ghana's local governance, but have taken the lead in electing MMDCEs without challenges. So we should begin to recognize that if people choose to have an MMDC, in fact, some in, in, in many areas, the DCE may be even more important to the local people than the uh, president. Is that not the case? Because it's the one they interact with and relate to all the time. So the, the DC may be an important person, very important person. So they must have the right to decide on who should be that uh, DC, that chief executive uh, for them. The election of MMDCEs is expected to form part of discussions at the 70th annual New Year School and Conference on the theme, Building Strong Institutions for Democratic Consolidation in Ghana. As a tradition, the resolutions from the school are presented in a communique for implementation by the various stakeholders. We believe that the school will have a new color and shape responding to the need of the country. The four-day annual New Year School and Conference is scheduled between January 14 and 18 at the University of Ghana, Lagos.